Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel, Rich43. Today we're building issue 16 of Build the Titanic from Hatchet Parkworks. If you're not already subscribed, please click that subscribe button. If you are subscribed, thank you so much. And if you do like the video, please like it. So yeah, if you're not subscribed, guys, please smash that subscribe button. Give me a big juicy thumbs up and please enjoy the video. So let's crack on. So let's have a look what's in this pack in the 16. Hope you're all doing good guys. I've missed you. Hope you miss me. Right. Yeah, I'm really appreciating all the um, subscribers I'm getting at the minute guys and all the likes and the comments. Really appreciate you supporting me on this journey. Please keep with me guys. Please keep me going on this journey to getting monetized by by um, October 2022 this year, obviously. Let's take a look through this mag. Again, we've got the usual stuff, like stuff what you probably wouldn't know about if you didn't read these mags between issues. I've not read any as yet, but they do look interesting, guys, from what I can see of them. I mean, you've got this fella here, I don't know who he is, but he'd be in first class. It's telling you things like that, and I would have thought it'll tell you who was at the bottom of the ship, third class and so on. But there's a lot of information in this, these mags, guys, what you can read between issues coming to your door. Right, so let's see what we've um, we've got to do this week. It's basically telling us first class gym and stairwell. Now we've got this part, which is, where have we got this part? No, we haven't, guys, we've got a new part then. Let's have a look what we've got before we read these instructions. It's getting together now, this is, I know we're in early days yet, but we're getting a lot of parts. Um, and I'm worried where I'm going to put it. <laughs> yeah, I'm worried where I'm going to put it. I'm going to have to. This studio, as you know, it's just um, for now, basically, how you can see what, where I'm working at. But my aim is is to make it a lot better um, and bigger than it is. And basically, the back wall, what you can see behind me when I'm filming the intros, I want to have a lot of big shelves at the back. Um, and then obviously put all the models I'm building, like the DeLorean, the Titanic, the Ferrari, the X-Wing will probably hang from the roof, to be fair. But yeah, before I keep gabbling on, let's see what parts we've got in this issue, guys. But I can't stress enough how much I'm, I'm really flattered how many subs I've got. I went up one, two I've gone up actually in the last two weeks. Um, I've gone up to 56 subs, which I know that's... That's, that's, I love that. I love I've got 56 subs, but compared to other sub, um, YouTubers, I'm sure they've got more than me, but we'll get there. It's work in progress. Let's have a look at it. You've got to keep cracking on. But anyway, 16A is a cold vent A, which is going to be this thing here. So that's cold vent A, 16A. So what I'll do is I'll put these at the top of the screen for you. Can just about see that until we need to use them guys and then we've got 16b which is cold vent b which is going to be this thing all these are plastic put it on my hand there you'll see how what size sort of size these things are but yeah these are all plastic guys i think there might be a bit of difference we'll have a look at them in a minute just because obviously vent a and vent b they're going to be a bit different so we'll have a look at them in a minute just so we know we're using the right ones then we've got 16c which is swan neck vent. I'll put that on my hand for you so you can see the size. Put that at the top. Um, and then we've got 16D. I'm sure we had one of these in the last issue, you know, what we didn't have to use. I wonder if we're going to use that today. That's the ventilator hood. So we'll put that there. I hope you can see them at the top of that screen, guys. And then we've got superstructure of the stairwell, which is this baby. Again, guys, this is plastic. 
it might not look much at the minute but i think once we start adding things to this and these parts it's going to really pop i mean you've got the windows here of the superstructure of the stairwell and obviously underneath here what i'm just about to pick up guys beware that it's flimsy you don't want to be ripping that if you did you could get around it but just be careful and this is the decking now as last week uh, it might be the week before when i put the decking on this part we're going to put a bit of glue on um because you don't want it peeling off further down the line especially when it's built and then you're going to have decking starting to peel up so what i'm going to do is use this glue it you can get this from the range guys in the uk and let me just double check where it's going yeah so it's going to go all on this piece so i'm going to put a bit of glue all the way around the edges Don't be shy to put it on, but just be careful you don't put too much on because it might overflow from under the decking and then you're going to have glue everywhere and you don't want that. I mean, Gorilla Glue is good as well, but this super glue does its job. I think I used Gorilla Glue on the last issue or when we put the decking on last, but I'm going to have a, um, give this glue it a try and see if this is just as good. So, all right, guys, you pull off this adhesive. So we're getting a T well into this now aren't we? we know what we're doing with these deckings because we've had a decking every other week i think now guys there is some holes what have got to be lined up here so you're gonna to have to make sure that i go straight on so i'm going to concentrate here a little second you're gonna to have to make sure you line the holes up should i say which shouldn't be too difficult guys i'm loving this build at the minute i really am loving it, it it's just it's it's not as it's easy. It is easy, but it's just it's, there's nothing gone wrong yet. <laughs> Dare I say that? I love it. I really do. It's so simple. The instructions are so good. I mean, it's basically click and connect. If that makes sense, it's just it, it does what it says on the tin. There's no. I don't, Dare I say this? There's no problems I'm having. It's just saying put that on. Look how easy that's gone on. See what I mean? That's, that's done. The only thing it's not telling you to do is put glue, but that's my, myself, I'm doing that because obviously I don't want it to peel up later down the life of the Titanic build. I don't want it on the mantelpiece in years to come on my shelf. And it's all peeling up because it's going to be a nightmare to stick. Obviously, once you've got all the stuff, what's going to make this, this stairwell pop or the decking of the Titanic pop? But yeah, guys, that's that done. That's the decking done. So we'll put that just to one side there. And it says take the swan neck vent 6C, which is going to be this. Yeah, it's that one. And then from the instructions, you can see if you remember the last issue, guys, it's saying one side is bigger than the other, the hole. So hang on, let me just pull this around for you and show you. If you look there, trying to, there you go. That hole is bigger than that one. So what it's saying is. With that that way that is going to fit into the holes as easy as that it's just going to push into there before I do that let me check glue is not necessary um, but it might help to hold the ventilator securely on the decking right so it's saying glue is not necessary but it'll hold it but you know what i'm going to put some glue on but you ain't got to go it's your discretion if you want to put glue you can if you don't you don't i'm going to because there'll be nothing worse if this falls off later down the life <laughs> Of the titanic so basically all we're doing is push that in there you hear that click done that is so simple guys i love it by any means it's not a toy it's not a simple build if that makes sense but in a way is you know what i'm saying it's just simple to put together so that's that done which you can see in that picture there then instruction three is saying get 16a now 16a is let me just have a look at these guys because i'm not sure if these are different or they're both the same anyway have a look so if you hold them yeah they're both going in so 16a is gonna be you can't hardly see that on the picture let's have a look on this picture here so it's going there and that's how it's got to look it's not that one it's gonna be that one see that little lip there 
how it's going to work is if we hold that like that you're going to push it in like that i'm not pushing it in as yet but that's, that's how i do it guys if you're not sure and the instructions are not as brilliant like the picture of it, it's not showing as good just do a dummy test like that that's going to be like that and you've got the sticking out bit here if you look at the diagram it looks exactly the same as on the diagram see what i mean see that's how i do it guys now again glue is not necessarily necessary should i say necessary sorry <laughs> but i'm going to put some on because it's saying you can if you want so we know guys we're not going to have to change these later date like we're having some more come through or something and we've got to take them off the deck and we know we're safe to glue it if we want to because that's what it's telling us you've got the bigger hole there and a the little one there so that's where we're putting it let's put it in as so there you go that is 16a cold vent a attached to the superstructure stairwell all right so let's turn the page looks like a quick on this does guys and uh, let's put that there in fact i'll put it as you can see it right the second cold vent 16b which is obviously this one Okay, and you know what's coming guys, apply a bit of glue. Like so. And then basically these two holes here, which you can see on the decking, one's bigger than the other. It's telling us to basically, I've put glue on now so I don't want to get stuck to me, but basically the vent's facing the same way as the um, vent 16A did. Yeah, that's right. So put that there. As simple as push into those holes. See, that's why a bit of glue is necessary, I think, on there. That's gone in fine. But as you see, that little gap there, it's not going to do nothing. But you just down and falling over, guys, and things like that. Like when the, the Titanic's built, you don't need these little parts falling over when your family, your friends are going to see them. See the Titanic on your shelf, and you don't these parts falling over, and you've got to try and glue them in when it's built because that would be an absolute nightmare. But, guys, that is it. We've started on the section of the superstructure, as you can see, um, where the second funnel will be mounted next to the skyline. Yeah, we've done that, it's just telling us what we've done. That is all we've got to do in this issue. I really hope you enjoyed this um, video guys i really do if you have please subscribe press the bell so you don't ever miss an issue of this coming up on my channel it's usually every monday as you know and if you are subscribed i really appreciate you guys i appreciate your views your subscribes um your likes your comments I really appreciate you guys i love your support you can give me i couldn't do this without you obviously this costs a lot of money to do this, which I'm not saying that just to get subscribers. I know what I was taking on when I did it, but the support would be very grateful. I just love doing, as you've seen in my vlogs and that, and past videos, I love doing these videos. Just, it keeps me sane, if that makes sense. It's mad, but I just love doing it. I've always wanted to do YouTube, so I thought I'd give it a go. And it seems to be working for me. I love editing, I love videoing. Well, before I keep gabbling on, store the ventilator hood 16D, careful. You don't need this in this issue. And I think we've got another one of these as well. But yeah, without me gabbling on, that is it for this week's issue. Well, that is it for issue 16, guys, of the Titanic build from Hashit Parkworks. We've done the stairwell, stairwell and the first class gym. Um, it was a straightforward build this week. I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Um, and if you've not subscribed and you don't want to miss any more of these videos to do the Titanic, please subscribe, smash that subscribe button, press the bell notification so you don't miss any future videos. Same with all my other channel stuff, all the videos on my channel, guys. If you don't want to miss any of my videos, if you like any of them, even if it's just one of them, hope you like all of them, please subscribe, press the bell notification. And please like the videos if you do like them. Give it a big juicy thumbs up. Comment down below if you've got anything to ask me or say to me. If you're doing the build along with me, perhaps comment and ask me any questions you want, guys. And please share it with all your friends, your family, 
any of your relatives, obviously, and anybody you know, even somebody on the street, just tell them my name, Rich43, YouTube channel. I appreciate your support, guys. I want to get out there. I want everyone to be watching my channel. I'm doing my best to put as much content, good content as I can, and I really hope you're enjoying these videos. Obviously, we've got the Titanic on Mondays. We've got the X-Wing on a Tuesday. Uh, WWE stuff, figures, maybe toys on a Wednesday. Putting Z900 content out. And then the Ferrari F40 on a Friday. There's more to come to the channel, guys. I mean, I've got um, other builds which I've not started on the channel yet. The Millennium Falcon, R2-D2, Dom's Charger. But they, I'm thinking they are going to be coming to the channel maybe later in the year. Um, autumn time, when I can't put as much bike content out. I mean, my aim is, guys, as I've said this before, if, you know, if you're not new to the channel and you know the channel, I want to be the first YouTuber to be doing models, vlogs, and Z900 content. I'm not sure if I am or not. I think I am. Definitely in the UK. I've not seen anyone doing that yet. We're doing models and motorcycle rides at the same time. It's either one or the other. I want a big collective of um, content on my channel. I want to be the first to be doing this. And I want to be getting new people to the channel from all sorts of life. And I want you to be watching me, Rich43, on my channel. I mean, I do vlogs as well, gym vlogs. I've not done one for a while. Oh, we've got the Back to the Future recap as well, my model, uh, 1.8 scale. Wicked car, that is. If you're already on the channel, you've seen the channel subscribed, you'll know what I want about there. I think I've done two or three videos of the Delorean. and it will be coming, guys, but I just want it to be the best content for you. I want to put the, the best views of the car and what it can do. That's my baby, that is. That's the first model I ever did. But yeah, enough about talking about all well, this is about the Titanic today. Um, but that's all to come, guys. That's all on the channel. So yeah, spread it around. Spread Rich43 around. All around the world. I want to get big, man. I want to be monetized. I want to be out there with all the other YouTubers. Will the Wayne, uh, Jared Campisi for the motorcycle riders in America. You've got MK. Those are the people I'm watching, guys. Check them out. The good. Will the Wayne, he's doing his own thing as well. He's doing the Titanic build. Check them out, guys. He's doing the wooden version as well of the Titanic, so that's a different aspect to the Titanic build. He's, he's, it's basically made out of wood. There might be a few metal parts, but you have to cut all the wood out and things like that. This is like basically just click and connect at the minute. I've got a feeling it might get a bit more complicated further down the line. We'll see. But I love a challenge. It can't be as bad as the DeLorean. <laughs> Trust me, that was... There was some tough times that, but I won't, I won't change it for the world. But anyway, enough of me gabbling on. Please, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Feel free to share the video. Comment down below, obviously, if you want to ask me anything or you're joining in with any of the builds I'm doing. And please, guys, support me on this journey. Smash the subscribe button. Give me a big juicy thumbs up. And help me get monetized by 2022, October 2022. But that is it for today's, for today's Build the Titanic. See you in the next one. I'll see you next week for the Titanic. See ya.